What you are about to hear is another prophecy from the prophet who prophesied Japan's judgments of God 16 years prior to March 11, 2011. www.dailymotion.com Prophecy to Japan 16 years prior to 2011. Jesus declares World War III on sinners worldwide. God is pissed off at sinners worldwide. Therefore, he has officially declared the start of WW3 on Earth. It is not being started by Russia, ISIS, Israel, or any other. I speak unto thee this day, and I say that I give my mercies to the faithful, to the truth. That is, when my people stay faithful unto me, stay faithful to the calling that I've called them unto, and remain ever faithful in the same, I say it is me, the living God, who shows them mercy again and again. For I say it is a joy unto me to reveal my mercy, to reveal my light, to reveal my goodness to those who are true to me. And I say that the wicked, the ones who are around and go astray, I say they will know my wrath revealed. Now I say this day when you look upon what it is that I the living God do intend, I say be thankful, ever thankful unto me. Now I say if you would really press in to praising and honoring me, giving thanks unto me always, you would see that I'm able, I'm able, I'm able. But I say when you are weighed down with criticism, when you are weighed down with accusation, when you are weighed down with doubt and fear and unbelief, then I say you do not see how many mercies I give unto my own. But I say when you will indeed thank me and praise me and thank me and praise me, then I say you will be uplifted in me. For I say it is me, the living God, who is indeed the way that is life, the way that is truth, the way that is mercy revealed. And it is me, the living God, who will indeed guide forth the ones who will be ever faithful unto me. That is, I will guide them in truth, I will guide them in mercy, I will guide them in life. And I say that I will bring forth the people who are honest with me. Now I say this day that I, the living God, do not call my people to live in darkness, to live in evil and iniquity, but I say that I call them to live in me. And I say that I call my people to be made glad, ever thankful, that indeed they are guided forth by me. That is, given the truth, the light, the mercy, the strength, and the hope day by day, and given the way wherein they can be kept, for I do give them the same. Now I say this day that I, the living God, do search the earth for the faithful, the true, the ones who will continue steadfast in me. And not only continue steadfastly believing and trusting and hoping in me, but praising and thanking me likewise. For I say that I do not intend that my people would be begrudging, resenting me, but I intend that my people would be renewed by thanking and praising me. That is, by truly allowing their eyes to be, to be opened, to behold the mercies I bring. Now I say it is me, the living God, who will deliver my people again and again and again out of the clutches of their enemies, and their foes shall not prevail against them. For I say, when my people remain ever faithful and true, though the plots of the wicked will be many, they shall not prevail. For I say, it is me, the living God, who will turn the plots of wickedness upon the wicked, and yes, they will be found under the same. And I say, they will enter into battle and find that they fight themselves. Now I say this day, be thankful that it is me, the living God, who will uplift and guide and direct you, if you remain true unto me. And I say, be thankful that I bring you forth as you will continue, trusting, believing, and looking to me. For I say that I do not call you to be in a ditch, to be in a pit, not at all. But I say that I call you to be renewed in the power of my presence, the strength of who I am. For I say it is me, the living God, who is the way of all righteousness, the way of all truth, the way of mercy provided. And it is me, the living God, who will indeed guide you forth as you will keep hoping in me. For I say it is me, the living God, who will hide you in the shadow of my wings and keep you, if you will but turn to me. For I say that I am able, therefore I say, trust and believe. Now I say, when you see the wicked who are caught up in their own evil schemes, their own evil plots, know they deserve what they get. For I say, when men will plot against my sacred ones, my holy ones, the ones who remain ever faithful and true unto me, then I say, they incur my wrath upon them. That is, they literally invoke my wrath because they plot against the just. And I say, it is me, the living God, who turns the wickedness back on them. Therefore I say, be thankful that it is me that you can keep serving, that it is me that you can follow after and seek to please. 
And I say, be thankful that I do uplift and guide you forth in the way of my truth, my light, my mercy revealed. And I say, be thankful that I give to you the purpose, the plan, and the light always. For I say, it is me, the living God, who will renew the strength of those who are ever trusting, believing, and looking to me. Now I say, this day, that I, the living God, do not call you to feel sorry for yourself, to weary yourself with self-pity, for the same is a destructive foe. And I say, you are not meant to give way to self-pity, but I say, you are meant to be thankful unto me. And I say, you are meant to be made glad that I do uplift and bring you forth. And I say, you are meant to be made glad that I purpose you in my life always. Now I say, this day, be glad that I give to you the privilege to believe upon me, to trust me and serve me day by day. And I say, be thankful that I purpose you in the blessedness, the truth, the light of who I am. For I say, when you will continue to trust, to believe, to look to me, then you are guided in my way. And yes, you are given the strength, the truth, the mercy, and the hope that I provide. Now I say this day that I, the living God, do not call my people to be found in the place of boredom, to be found in the in the place of unfaithfulness towards me. For I say, when you see the ones who turn aside to play the whore, know they pay in their play. That is, it is me, the living God, who is indeed kindled in my anger and sore displeasure against them, and they will not know the abundance of my mercies in their lives. But I say they are the ones who will suffer because of their choices against me. But I say when any man or woman will choose to believe upon me, to be guided forth in me, and directed in my way, then I say they are given my mercy time and again. And yes, they are uplifted, directed, and brought forth by me. Now I say this day counted a privilege to keep on trusting, to keep on believing, to keep on hoping in me. For I say it is me, the living God, who guides you forth in the newness of life, the truth, the strength, and the mercy that I provide. And it is me, the living God, who will give unto you such as you need to be ever kept in me. Now I say this day that I, the living God, do not call you to walk in estrangement from my arrangement, not at all. But I say that I call you to be coming forth renewed in me, for I am the one who is able. That is, I'm able to uplift the guide to direct and correct you day by day. And I say that I'm able to give unto you such as you need, because it is me that you serve. Now I say this day, be thankful that I am the one who will uplift you, direct you, and bring you forth. And I say, be thankful that I am the one who will guide you in the newness of life that I provide. And I say, be thankful that I do purpose, direct, and correct you, for you are mine. For I say, it is me, the living God, who is the truth, the light, the strength, the mercy, and the hope intended for those who believe upon me. Therefore I say, stay faithful, stay true, stay steadily believing in me, for I will bring you forth. And yes, I will give unto you such as you need time and again, for I am indeed well able. And I say that I'm able to give you the abundance of mercy, the abundance of truth, and the life that I provide. For I say it is me, the living God alone, who is able, therefore I say continue in my way. Now I say this day that you are living in times when many will find themselves under my wrath because they have been displeasing unto me. That is, they have committed themselves to sin, they have committed themselves to idolatry and transgression against me, that they wonder at the misery that comes upon them. But I say, if a man will stay faithful and true and keep on praising, keep on serving, keep on loving me, then I say that he's guided forth by me. And yes, he has given the blessedness, the truth, and the light of who I am. Now I say this day that I, the living God, do not call you to walk in the weariness, the dreariness of your own understanding, not at all. But I say that I call you to be uplifted and guided, directed, corrected, and given the hope of who I am. For I say it is me, the living God, who is the way of all righteousness and truth, the way of all mercy and strength, and the way that is peace provided for those who believe upon me. And I say, when you will come forth in that which I give, then you are guided in my life. Now I say this day that I, the living God, will give the clear way, the clear light, the clear truth to all who believe upon me. And I say, when it is me that you will be believing and trusting, it is me who will guide you in life. And it is me who will give to you tender mercy that you can indeed be kept each day by me, and guided in that which I give you time and again. 
Therefore, I say, be thankful, ever thankful that you can continue in me. You can see what many mercies I give to those who are mine. And I say, when you will continue in the way of truth and light, then you are given my hope day by day. And yes, you are directed, corrected, and shown the light, for I will give you the same. And I say that you can be made glad for the privilege to believe upon me. I say this day that I, the living God, do call you to be ever thankful. I call you to be ever guided. I call you to walk in the way that I give. For I say it is a good thing, a sweet thing, a blessed thing to partake of me. And I say, when I, the living God, do shine my light upon the pathway, and you will walk in the same, then you can be made glad in me. For I say that I am the truth, the light, the strength, the mercy, and the hope given to my own. And I say that I will encourage the man who is to be found in thanksgiving and praise unto me. I say this day, do not go in the way of the bitter, do not go in the way of the accusers, the abusers, the losers who are fools before me. For I say they fail to thank me and praise me, they fail to believe upon me, but I say they believe the picture the enemy paints before them. Then I say they pull down their own houses because they believe the lies of the liar rather than trusting in me. I say this day, do not trust the liar, but trust me, for I am thy God. And I say, if you will keep steadily looking unto me, believing in me, then you are guided forth by me. And yes, you are given the blessedness, the mercy, the truth, and the light of who I am. And yes, you are ever guided, for I will bring you forth. For I say, it is me, the living God, who is the way that is mercy and truth, hope and life, and peace given to my own. And it is me, the living God, who does give to the ones who serve me the way wherein they can be kept each day. Now I say this day that I, the living God, do call you to walk uprightly. I say that I call you to be coming forth, and I call you to be instructed by me. For I say, when you walk in the calling, when you remain in the same, you prove you are faithful to me. For I say, you are not meant to deviate nor turn, you are meant to remain ever true. And I say, you are meant to thank me and praise me, no matter what it is that I take you through. For I say, it is me, the living God, who delivers you out of the clutches of the enemies, the wicked doers, the ones who plot evil against the just. For I say, that it is me, the living God, alone, who is able. And I say to the ones who remain ever repentant and true, the pathway of life is set before them. But I say to the ones who give way to wickedness, who give way to evil imagination and unbelief, I say they are taken in the way of corruption. And yes, they will know the sorrow, the emptiness, the futility, the despair of their own way. I say thank me and praise me that you can indeed remain in my way and not be found under the wrath revealed but that you can come forth ever thankful to partake of tender mercy, loving kindness, and the goodness that I provide. For I say it is me, the living God, who will guide you forth in the way of my truth, my light, my mercy revealed. And it is me, the living God, who will give you my peace upon the pathway day by day.